Welcome to Rick Snyder's Washington on YouTube, where you get the whole story. So please like, share, subscribe, comment, and hit that thanks button. Monday night, 8 to 9 Eastern on live YouTube. Going to talk commanders and everything else, so come on back then. All right, Josh Harris, the Washington Commanders owner, has made his first mistake. You don't send out ticket renewal forms when the team's losing four straight, looking at four more losses right before Christmas and looking for money. No, 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 no. Josh, what are you doing? Now listen, Josh Harris is a money guy. I understand that. Josh Harris has got to get some of his money back after spending $6 billion. $6 billion. I mean, okay, I, I get that too. I'm a capitalist at heart too. All right, but not before Christmas during a losing streak. One thing I noticed the commanders have stopped doing this season is sending out Monday morning uh, merchandise emails. Maybe it's just me, but they quit sending them after losses and going, oh boy, you want more stuff. And I thought, this is so tone deaf. Well, this was kind of a tone deaf move. Could have waited till after the holidays, then hit people for a big increase. Not just the money, but an increase. Josh Harris is not going to be the next Jack Kent Cook. And I'll tell you why. Very different world, okay? The team was valued at maybe 200, 250 million back then. Now it's 6 billion. So you're looking at that huge increase. Jack Kent Cook ran the team, owned the team for the fun of it more than anything. But in the end of the day, he was willing to put his, all his money in on this team because when he died in 1997 and they looked over to his whole estate to figure out what to do with it, they said, wait a minute, there's no money anywhere. He's leveraged it all for this team. It was the only asset he had left. He always just loved to say, I own the Chrysler building. Yeah, but it was 100% mortgage in the end because he put the money into the football team. Harris can't afford to do that. Nobody can today at this valuation. So that's the new world. You think these ticket prices are high now? Just wait till you get the new stadium. I'm Rick Snyder. Thanks for coming. I'll see you soon. Maybe eight to nine night.